Hey everybody, how you doing? NASCAR Camping World Gander Truck Series open at Chicago Land Speedway. I'll be in the studio, David Bursa Thunder Ford F-150 number 27 truck today. I'm starting fifth in a field of 29. Race length is 80 laps, which equals 120 miles. Chicago Land Speedway is a one and a half mile tri-oval. There's 18 degree banking in the turns, 11 degree banking on the front stretch, and five degree banking on the back stretch. Around the bottom. All right, qualified fifth. Uh, 27 seed truck out of 28. I believe this is the second split Monday night after the change. 150 drivers in the practice lobby. Been a while since I did one of these. But I'm going camping this week uh, for a four nighter, so I need to get this out and up. It'll probably be mainly just in car to facilitate that because. I'm forcing the VP09 playback Kodak for you guys uh, with the 1440p upload, and that takes about a day to cook on YouTube's end. So I'm running VRS's test uh, setup for this season, uh, this yeah, season three here, if you will, or whatever you want to call it in the trucks. Uh, got my buddy David Prince. He is starting in 24th in the 23rd seed truck. Yeah, v check, please, please. VRS uh, didn't offer up anything new from last Excellent. quote season, and uh, but they put up a test, and uh, I kind of like it. It, it. it the tire fall off feels a little bit more significant to me, but then again, I was running flat out, foot to the floor in practice with uh, no <laughs> competition. Uh, yeah, and additional set of tires for this race. 15 laps, and and so that's, you know, we're going to get, we can get tires every 20 laps if we want to here. 80 laps, four sets. So it, it seems to like to run out a little high, middle to high lane. Usually I'm down on the low on the apron, you know, so we'll just see how this goes. I probably will give up some spots at the beginning. Because I didn't qualify with my qualifying, with their qualifying setup been doing that recently here and so far I have not forgot to change it when we get to the race. I have done that in the past. Yeah, going camping for the first time in almost a year it feels. Four nights at Twin Anchors, fireworks, private fireworks show on Saturday night. I'm doing it to kind of save the tires just a little bit. All right, good little breakout. Leader got dead sideways. Ooh, and 
not get sideways. Oh, and I, 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 you know what? I saw that coming, and I thought I'm going to be able to just steer by him. And I all but had you cleared, 17. Sorry about that. And there's no caution. Wow. I did not hear them guys say there were no caution. I now get it. Wow, wow, wow. Alright, let's see how bad we are. Leader's right behind me. Oh, I'm dead slow. So that effectively ended my race. Let's go back and take a look at the replays here. Coming down out of four into the trial. Well, I do touch the apron a little bit, but that has nothing to do with anything. It's 17 self spins. He catches it. I thought he was going to the wall. I went left. I didn't want to go too far down on the apron. Had a 22 out on the outside. You know, just one of those situations. I aimed for the accident. It was supposed to not be there by the time I got there. But again, he did a great job of actually, from his point of view, correcting it and not going to the wall. Looking out the back here. Again, I just touched the apron, nothing major there, and you see a little smoke there. And I could have jumped up in front of the 22, but when we go to the the rough cam, you know, I've already made my bed. I just, I cannot dive out to the wall that hard, and I thought he was going to the wall. You know, it's just one of those deals. See, I thought he was shooting toward the wall, so I went left, you know, kept my foot into it. Yep, and there it is. That's all she wrote. Just a whole lot of nothing I could have done, really. I, you know, I saw it. I maintained my line. He should have gone to the wall, <laughs> and I would have been okay. And then we all get down in the grass here, all four of us that are involved with this, and no caution. So I don't think a caution would have helped me too much. I had so much damage. So, so I limp around for about 15 laps and decided to come in and uh, get some repairs after going a lap down, and they were just about ready to lap me again. And when I was on, I was Lucky Dog at only three laps down at that point. Uh, but apparently you don't get Lucky Dog when the caution flies and you happen to be on pit road. So learn something there. So then I took a few minutes of repairs and went out and uh, just fell right off the, the lead pack. You know, like I had an anchor out back. So then I came down and did all the repairs. went out and then popped the engine. So a terrible outing here at Chicagoland for the Camping World Gander Studio David Bursa Thunder F-150. Ended up finishing in 25th place, about 27 laps down. Took a big hit on the safety rating, a big hit on the SR. Well, as they say, that's the way it goes. All right, guys, thanks for coming along for the ride, and we'll see you next time.